so it is week six going into week seven and time to present a draft of your sustainability plan as proposed. So this is a, a process, this whole course is a process where you are working to craft a brief to present to the CEO of a company. And you want to address an awful lot of elements. So you want to address not only the SDGs and related KPIs that you have determined are appropriate to evaluate or measure how the organization is doing um, in its pursuit of sustainability while maintaining or protecting the brand, but you also want to include a description of the organization. Each organization has its own personality and that personality, that profile is what allows it to choose a credible or an appropriate strategy in terms of social metrics, right? So it needs to make sense. Um, what an athletic team would choose is very different from what an auto manufacturer or um, a recycling company would use. Um, and then of course, you want to be able to recommend strategies. That's the oversight, the big picture and tactics, the actual actions that go into the plan. And then you wanna synthesize everything you've learned in such a way that you can report it succinctly, professionally at the executive level to this primary decision maker. So to be successful, you want to understand each of these elements and have it clearly sussed out in your document. The document needs to be something that a CEO could read in five minutes and go, ah, I understand clearly what you're proposing. It should be sufficient so that the CEO can ask questions about it. Um, without feeling foolish or thrashing around looking for information. In other words, what you present should be a nice package of information that cuts to the chase, the kind of thing that you could present in seven PowerPoint slides in five minutes or seven, I guess it's seven minutes. And, and, and your viewer would, is able to um, ask questions, be knowledgeable, and actually begin planning and acting or creating groups and task force groups to act on the information in the briefing. Now, what you will get back after you submit the draft is feedback to help you finalize a well-crafted brief. So the feedback, it's not an edit, it's feedback. So if it is suggested that um, you have, you know, one and a half page paragraphs need to be broken up in a way that makes more sense, just because it's mentioned once does not mean that is not applicable to all of the long paragraphs in your paper. That is an example. So feedback is coaching and guidance on how to improve your deliverable because your deliverable is a primary part of your final grade. I hope you've enjoyed working on um, this project and that it has um, allowed you to understand more about how organizations uh, integrate sustainability into their operating and um, success plans. Good luck.